Good morning, church. Welcome to your Thursday. I hope the week has been good to you so far. Today we're going to read from Psalm 126, and it's pretty short, so I'm going to read it through twice. Give you a little break in between to kind of think about it a little bit, and then I'll jump into it again. Listen now for the word of God. When the Lord restored the fortunes of Zion, we were like those who dream. Then our mouth was filled with laughter and our tongue with shouts of joy. Then it was said among the nations, the Lord has done great things for them. The Lord has done great things for us and we rejoiced. Restore our fortunes, O Lord, like the watercourses in the Negeb. May those who sow in tears reap with shouts of joy. Those who go out weeping, bearing the seed for sowing, shall come home with the shouts of joy carrying their sheaves. Let's hear that again. When the Lord restored the fortunes of Zion, we were like those who dream. Then our mouth was filled with laughter and our tongue with shouts of joy. It was said among the nations, the Lord has done great things for them. The Lord has done great things for us and we rejoice. Restore our fortunes, O Lord, like the watercourses in the Negeb. May those who sow in tears reap with shouts of joy. Those who go out with weeping, who go out weeping, bearing the seed for sowing, shall come home with shouts of joy, carrying their sheaves. Let's pray. Gracious and loving God, whatever the day may bring, be it joy or sorrow. We pray always for you to work good for us and for your people. May we, if we weep for now, may we have rejoicing in the time to come. And if we do not weep now, then let us share the joy with others. In Jesus' holy name we pray. Amen. Thanks for tuning in, folks. If you think someone else could benefit from hearing this, go ahead and share this video on your social media or send it around in emails to folks and bless them with the scripture today. Have a wonderful day. Take care of yourselves. Be kind to yourselves and one another. And I'll see you next time.